morning, if I could find a little cubicle like this to camp in every time there was a storm, I'd be a very content little camper. Um, the rain hasn't started yet, uh, it's coming I'm sure, and the wind is coming pretty violently from the south which is the way I'm going. So I guess the plan is to um, get to the first open cafe and then um, just sit there, charge everything, use the Wi-Fi and then um, by the afternoon it's supposed to be better so I can have a day or half a day. The screws holding on the roll-off gear changer have worked their way a bit loose so I finally know why I've been carrying this particular tool. bit draftier but how cool would it have been to have camped here? <laughs> Too early, it's not even 8am so nothing's open and it's still not raining, uh, the weather looks better to the south so I'm going to take my chances and crack on to the next town, 20 miles away which could take a couple of hours in this wind. so far. It's all right when I'm sheltered from the wind, um, but when it becomes more open, it's a bit more problem. Third gear. Italian cappuccino and pastry. We've got four things plugged into the wall. Hopefully I've rented the space for a couple of hours. This cake is warm. It's got kind of custard inside it. Oh my gosh, this is the best thing I've eaten yet. One euro, two euros. Brilliant. Hear that familiar clank and sure enough, loose pannier rack. I don't think I've been on bumpier roads than usual, but maybe I should check the other screws. I can't tell you how quickly the weather has changed. Ten minutes ago it was absolutely persisting down, and now the sun's up. You beauty! Gosh, this place is like a museum. Wild.
1480, 813 locals were beheaded by the invading Ottomans for refusing to convert to Islam. This looks to me like a colour chart for picking what type of marble you wanted to obtain from. This installation is named La Prodo or The Landing by Greek artist Kostas Forostos. The boat was the Katari Iradas which sank off the coast of Otranto in 1997 causing the drowning of 87 Albanian asylum seekers. Most easterly point in Italy, check, but I've messed up. I've left town without filling my water bottles and I'm ready to camp. I don't really have enough water, so I need to keep going further than I would like so I can have a comfy camp. Okay, this is my emergency option. It looks clean and fresh enough. Fantastic. There is no mad weather forecast tonight, so I can have a nice looking campsite. This patch here looks just about to be rock free and the view is bonkers. 